It's a big brand for us. Obviously, it's the king of beers. Devin Pershke, owner of Weber Street Liquor, was disappointed when he heard that Anheuser-Busch may be watering down its Budweiser and Michelob brands. I think people will be put off because, I mean, that's false advertising. Take, for example, the Bud Light Platinum. There's a big, bold number on the package stating 6% alcohol. So it's been around for a year, and it's been a, it's been a good seller for them. But with the lawsuit, Pershke fears the bottles that were coming out may be going back in. I think it potentially could hurt their sales and their reputation. It could clear the path for competitors to roll on in and steal customers. Or it could do nothing at all. Beer drinkers loyal to their brand may just shrug the lawsuit off. Phil DeHaan, owner of Oscars on Tejon Street, doesn't think his patrons will change their mind. They're probably going to drink what they're going to drink anyway. He says it's flavor that keeps someone drinking a brand, not so much the alcohol content. Budweiser is known for, you know, being a lager or a lighter style beer. While it may just be a number game for some, others are unsure about the label and what's factual. It's one more reason to be suspect of corporate America. Samantha Anderson, KRDO News Channel 13.